Kiwanis is a global organization of volunteers dedicated to changing the world, one child and one community at a time. The Kiwanis organization is about 100 years old, and there are over 6,000 clubs worldwide. The Kiwanis Club of Carefree is in the top 10 of all clubs in the world. We have 200 members who are volunteering to make a difference in our community. The Kiwanis of Carefree is now celebrating over 40 years as a service club. Since the early 70s, the Kiwanis Club of Carefree has made many contributions. They donated the sundial to the town of Carefree. They also built the Dave Anderson Building, where they currently have the flea market. They are now going to expand the flea market into the Kiwanis Marketplace. Kiwanis Club has always been active in the Foothills community. They especially support children at the high school and other children's activities. We appreciate what they do for this entire community. The Kiwanis is an integral part of the community of Cave Creek. The organization supports our library, our museum, through scholarships, children in our community. It is absolutely essential, the work that the Kiwanis does to make the community of Cave Creek vibrant and to give it purpose. Carefree Kiwanis is all about kids. When you think of Carefree Kiwanis, you should picture the students in our school district in Cave Creek that benefit from the science fair, from recognition programs, from scholarships. It's all focused on students. Key Club is one of the many Kiwanis-sponsored clubs offered to local area students. We are proud to be involved in the many programs that teach leadership skills, promote community service, and improve the lives of children. Hi, I'm Manny, past president of Carefree Kiwanis. I'm also the current Key Club chairman for Desert Foothills Key Club. Key Club is a worldwide organization of 260,000 members in 30 countries. Desert Foothills Key Club is a, is a community key club that brings in any member of high school that wishes to join a community service club. Community service is where it's at. When they, when, when they get involved in community service and they feel it and see it, you see it in their faces and the light comes on, there's nothing better. Key Club teaches a lot of really good values. Um, uh, one, I think, is just that work ethic, that idea of delayed gratification, that you don't get things right today, but you may have to work for things. Also, the value of just serving people without actually expecting to get anything in return. They are fabulous kids, and it really gives them a different look at the environment and nature. Uh, it helps us out. It helps them build uh, some sense of, of value. I like the feeling you get through service. I like how rewarding it feels when, you like, when, you're, when you're out here and you just kind of feel how much of a difference you're making. Because if one person did this, it would be a week's project. And by the time you finish, you'd have to do it all over again. But when you get 30, 40 people out here, you get it done in three hours. And it's, it's a good feeling to feel like you can help someone out like that. I feel really good after I have a go to a key club event because I feel like I just took love and put work boots on and turned it into kindness, if that make, does not make any sense. So service is just love with its work boots on, right? I love Key Club so much. It's a great organization and I think it's the best thing for this community. You get to help people every single day and I've heard the people around you ask you what is Key Club and how can I get involved and that's the best satisfaction for me is people want to get involved because they see how much fun it is. That basically that there's an investment that happens within the community um, that pays a lot more than just a paycheck or an ice cream cone or something that's rather simple. The rewards are friendship, their um, uh, community feeling, a feeling of belonging and uh, that that's something that I don't see really anywhere else in the teen experience other than service clubs that are very much like Key Club. Well, we've been involved with uh, helping the Kiwanis with the flea market for years, and Key Club provides a lot of just kind of labor. We, we pick up all this furniture, essentially, for the flea markets, and, you know, they almost all of them are veterans, and they tell you their war stories, or they tell you their, their you know, their, their, their life stories, and uh, you learn a lot of good life lessons beyond, beyond just um, the importance of serving your community. I've been in Key Club for three years now, and I've been helping the flea market ever since. It gives me a good chance to work with the Kiwanians and get more in touch with the community. It's great. I know it's really fun for one thing. I know we're doing it for a good cause. It's, the flea market is probably one of my favorite events Key Club does.
I'm the chair of the Autism Committee for Carefree Kiwanis. Working with our local schools, we learned that the young people with autism have a specific challenge in getting a job due to communication skills. So we pioneered a Get a Job boot camp to help them learn how to handle themselves in interviews so that they can get a job and use their skills. Kiwanis Club has enabled us to bring our students from Foothills Academy to their boot camp, which is a meeting to meet inspiring people in the field that our students have interests and also learn how to present themselves. They get up with an elevator pitch at the end of the meeting. Everyone enjoys it. Hi, I'm Kathy. I'm a former president of the Carefree Kiwanis Club, and I'm currently the advisor to the Action Club. The Action Club was formed four years ago to serve the needs of developmentally disabled young adults in our community. We have about 17 to 20 members and they get together twice a month, do service projects and have great fellowship. Hi, I'm Stephanie. I'm a Action Club member and I'm president. I, I like the um, Action Club. I'm passionate and I work very hard. Action Club makes me good confidence, make new friends. Our Action Club is supported by the Kiwanis of Carefree. It is important that we get the new building built so that the money raised can continue supporting Action Club and all the other wonderful Kiwanis activities. I'm hoping that when we are able to build a building, we will be able to put community members that are developmentally disabled to work. We'll provide employment, they'll be paid for their work, and it'll all happen because of the new building for the Kiwanis Flea Market. Building a better community is a primary mission of the Carefree Kiwanians. We have partnered with many of the nonprofit organizations within our community who provide much needed services. Hi, Pam with the Foothills Food Bank, celebrating 25 years of giving assistance with food, resources, and finance, finances. And the Kiwanians have been with us. Carefree Kiwanis has helped support us by giving financial assistance and also gift cards during the holiday time. Carefree Kiwanis has been helping people in our communities for many, many years. Now it is time for us as a community to come forward to help Carefree Kiwanis build their new marketplace. The Kiwanis Club of Carefree and the Desert Foothills Library have had a long-standing relationship. The mission of Kiwanis Club relates primarily to children and um, in the library we have approximately 25% of our space which is dedicated to servicing the children and youth of the area. Approximately three years ago uh, the library was uh, very fortunate to receive um, a much larger grant from Kiwanis Club which enabled us to do some remodeling of the children's area. Much like the community support that the library received when it was building this new facility, the Kiwanis Club of Carefree needs your support. Hi, Deborah Detterman with Foothills Caring Corps. We provide services to older adults to help them maintain themselves in their homes for as long as possible. Kiwanis and Foothills Caring Corps together are able to work in the community and give out wheelchairs and walkers and needed medical loan closet items so that they can maintain themselves in their own home after a surgery or after a chronic illness. We're pleased to work together with Kiwanis on the medical loan closet. In our small communities, we all support one another. Foothills Caring Corps is very supportive of the marketplace and would hope that you all would join us in that support. Hi, my name is Katie Smintana, and I'm the Executive Director for the Desert Foothills Family YMCA. Kiwanis was an instrumental partner to help us build our facility here at Desert Foothills, and the funds they donated specifically went to our amazing kids facility, where we see over a thousand kids on a monthly basis. I also, with Carefree Kiwanis as a member today, am involved in their terrific kids program. This is a program specifically focused on the elementary schools within the Cave Creek School District, where we focus on core values and goal setting. Setting. The partnership between Carefree Kiwanis and the Desert Foothills YMCA makes a whole ton of sense. We're both focused on kids, core values, 
goal setting and giving back to the community. I cannot thank Kiwanis Carefree enough for helping us start our organization here up at Desert Foothills. We appreciate any donations that you can provide to help Carefree Kiwanis have a building of their own with the new marketplace. With the help of Carefree Kiwanis, Foothills Community Foundation is able to invest in the children and youth of our community. Through our youth theater, we develop discipline, self-confidence, and teamwork skills. Through our Desert Reach program, we provide a unique hands-on educational program about the Sonoran Desert in every fourth grade classroom. The Holland Community Center provides a place where children and youth meet, learn, and just have fun. Through Partners in Education, we provide scholarships for children and teacher grants to encourage educational innovation. Foothills Community Foundation encourages you to invest in the Kiwanis Carefree Marketplace. We know that Kiwanis will continue investing in our communities and continue creating a better tomorrow. Hi, I'm Matt Woosley. I'm with the Cub Scout Pack 331 here in Cave Creek, as well as the Builders Club at Sonoran Trails. And uh, Kiwanis has helped us with our, uh, I'm a DIN leader with the pack, but I also do a lot of our outdoor activities. And we're working on something called the Chuck Wagon Project, which Kiwanis is helping us fund that. And uh, that will be an equipment trailer for the kids and a lot of the parents who don't camp. So they can just come and be a part of the activities and we can focus on the activities for the boys instead of them worrying about having to come up with all that extra cost for the equipment. And then with the Builders Club, uh, it's a brand new endeavor. We're starting that at the middle school where it's kind of a pre-key club. The kids get to learn how to organize themselves, have a meeting before they go on to high school as part of the key club. Uh, hey, community, please support the building of a new marketplace. It, it would be very advantageous. Um, I definitely think that you should support the uh, new marketplace because of how much the Kiwanis help the community. They help the youth and the elderly and raising that much money will really help us all. So I feel like the marketplace is going to be really important, especially because last year I was a scholarship recipient from Kiwanis and by building the marketplace, or the new one at least, it will provide Kiwanis with an opportunity to make more money, which will then make more scholarships for the students. I do see myself being a Kiwanian one day. It's a really cool club and there's a lot of really cool people and I hope to turn into one of those cool people. It's like the heart of the community in my opinion is what Kiwanis is and so when we look at the community as a whole we have this reputation of being charitable, we have this reputation of caring about our youth and I think that that building will be almost a symbol of that if that makes sense. Now we need your help. The new marketplace building will cost one and a half million dollars and we want the building to be debt free so that we can increase and continue our vital community support. I wanted to thank you for viewing our short, important video that will help us do more for our children in our community via the marketplace.